Hi, welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got during our half trading day of July 21, 2020. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of half a percent. You may expect now a sell return of 0.6%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $268.49, but we expect a possible sell price of $272.11. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Dow Jones Industrial ETF, if it is over 3.50% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, Dow Jones Industrial ETF has a striking price at $275. For this option, the actual put price is at $7, but we expect a possible put price at $5.18. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Energy sector ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Halliburton Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $13.82. For put option, a possible put price is at $0.88. Occidental Petroleum is a weak sell suggestion. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 1.1%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.6%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $16.84. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Occidental Petroleum, if it is over 3.85% of your stock price trade. On the put option table. Occidental Petroleum has a striking price at $17. For this option, the actual put price is at $0.59, but we expect a possible put price at $0.97. Financial Sector ETF belongs to the Bull Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock stable of financial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. American International G is a mild sell suggestion. It is on a trade high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 
you may expect now a sell return of 1.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $31.81, but we expect a possible sell price of $32.46. In addition, we suggest to stop selling American International G. If it is over 5.50% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, American International G has a striking price at $33. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.52. But we expect a possible put price at $1.31. BlackRock was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that BlackRock is a bull normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 3.0%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $573.8. But we expect a possible buy price of $569.06. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $596.53, and is overvalued. On the put option table, BlackRock has a striking price at $600. For this option, the actual put price is at $20.5. But we expect a possible put price at $7.79. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today. Our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of real estate sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Boeing Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.9%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $179.73. For put option, a possible put price is at $10.99. Material sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of material sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Ecolab Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $209.21. For call option, a possible call price is at $4.25. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell air products chemicals. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of half a percent. You may sell it at a minimum price of $278.77. For put option, a possible put price is at $10.54. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of discretionary sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Netflix Incorporated. 
you can observe, it has an expected buy return of 9.7%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $499.08. For call option, a possible call price is at $15.8. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Amazon Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.6%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $3,095.1. For put option, a possible put price is at $162.53. Amazon Incorporated was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Amazon Incorporated is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 3.8%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.6%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $3,083.31. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $3,230.41 and is overvalued. On the put option table, Amazon Incorporated has a striking price at $3,300. For this option, the actual put price is at $263.73, but we expect a possible put price at $162.53. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Staples sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Mondelez International is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 1.6%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.2%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $53.52, but we expect a possible sell price of $54.48. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Mondelez International, if it is over 4.05% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, Mondelez International has a striking price at $55. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.51, but we expect a possible put price at $1.35. Procter & Gamble was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Procter & Gamble is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.7%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $124.96, but we expect a possible buy price of $124.31. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $127.74 and is overvalued. On the put option table. Procter & Gamble has a striking price at $130. For this option, the actual put price is at $5.45, but we expect a possible put price at 4. Point. Walmart Corporation was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Walmart Corporation is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.7%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.2%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $130.41, but we expect a possible buy price of $129.59. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $136.6 and is overvalued. On the put option table, Walmart Corporation has a striking price at $135. For this option, the actual put price is at $3.65, but we expect a possible put price at $3. Technology sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell.
let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell automatic data processing. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $148.33. For put option, a possible put price is at $5.57. Communication sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of communication sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Comcast Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $41.9. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.3. Utility sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utility sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell NextEra Energy. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $264.96. For put option, a possible put price is at $9.09. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good update of our half trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.